Uh, high scoring affair, right? Um, and so, <laughs> you know what? I think, uh, you know, a lot of respect for Valpo. Uh, Valparaiso is a, a tremendous program, great tradition. Uh, they have a really good coach, and um, their kids play extremely hard. And so we have a, a huge amount of respect for them uh, and what they've accomplished and what, what they do uh, and what they've done over the years. Um, I'm extremely proud of our guys. I, I think, uh, you know, the resiliency, uh, the character of our group, uh, others got, got to see, have gotten to see it this, this weekend. Because uh, every day this group shows up uh, in spite of the record and they are just hungry to learn. Uh, they want to get better. We, we work like crazy. Uh, and you would not know uh, if you came to watch a practice what the record was. It's just, um, you know, I'm just proud of them for being consistent uh, in their approach. And we've talked about, you know, uh, pounding the rock and, and you never know when it's going to break. And, and so we've just been pounding, pounding, pounding like crazy. Uh, these guys have been leading. And so, you know, we we're fortunate tonight. They, they missed a few shots. Uh, we missed a few as well. And that was, uh, we just talked about being tough. And I thought our guys were tough down the stretch. These guys have had a next play mindset. There's, there's a lot of conversations going on in the huddles. And it's been all about what's next, coach. Uh, and so I was proud. That's, that's, a, that's a moment of, um, you know, you're disorganized when that ball comes off the rim. And I big, I think Brett Prawl was in at the time. I did a great job of being a wall and protecting, you know, anything coming downhill. Uh, it's a little different because I'm playing a little bit more. But um, somebody told me that yesterday, and I didn't. I thought about it, I'm like, it's kind of deja vu. And um, I'm just glad where I am right now with this team. And um, we're going to lace them up Monday night against whoever and go out there and try and win the championship. I mean, it's, it's a little frustrating and fun at the same time. Um, I mean, when you're down on offense, you don't, you don't see the ball going in. And then on defense, you're just like, kind of like, oh, crap, you know, make sure we get the stop. So, I mean, anytime they score, it seems like you got to score. But just like Coach said, it's March, and that, that's the way the feeling is. And um, we, we keep like playing defense like this. We're, we'll be a hard team to beat. Yeah, no question. Uh, no question. After we lost at, uh, against Oakland uh, at Sunday at our place, and they won a championship on our court, uh, our guys were not happy about that. Uh, neither was I. And we put the rank, the league standings on the, on the board and um, the points that we lost by. You know, you talk at Oakland, we go to, we have the game, we're at overtime, we're at the foul line with five seconds to go. At Valpo, we're down three with three minutes to go. Northern Kentucky, we split. Green Bay, we lose by six. And we went on down and said, you know, why can't we win against any of these teams on a neutral floor? Um, now we'll have to play well. And we'll have to play defense like we have the past two nights, but uh, they never lost belief in this group. And so if you told me we were only going to get 10 wins uh, and 9 and 10 were going to be <laughs> yesterday and today, I'll, I'll take it. No, it was, it was uh, hey, we just held Valparaiso to 12 points in the first half. Uh, so be proud of that. And I thought, you know, we've had moments uh, this season where we weren't making shots. Lord knows we've struggled to score at times. We've gone on these long droughts. And it affected us on the defensive of the floor defensive end of the floor. And I thought, you know, just seeing the maturity of our group, like they definitely weren't going in tonight. We both shot 25% in the first half, uh, but we didn't let it affect our defense. And that, that's a great sign of maturity. Like guys can move on to the next, next possession. Uh, and so that's how you get these things done. It can be overwhelming if you're thinking about beating Valpo and you're thinking about the tournament and all these things. And so if you're only thinking about the next play and you stay in that moment, uh, that, that's more what we focused on. And so I'm proud of our guys for just being locked in on that.